Five years ago, Hunter Azure gave up wrestling. After four state titles at Poplar and a few inconsistent years at MSU Northern, injuries forced him to walk away. From ACLs, both my ACLs, meniscuses, that hand surgery, so it just kind of, to me, I kind of, I feel like it set me back. But Azure knew he had a lot left in the tank. After I recovered from some injuries and I was started, I've always worked out, so I was feeling great and I was like, I, I, I knew I could, I always wanted to fight and I knew I could do it. I just signed up for an amateur fight in Montana one weekend and then just fell in love since and took a couple fights and I was like, this is what I'm going to do. He took more fights, moved to Arizona to train and transformed himself into one of the brightest MMA prospects in the country. And next week, he'll take the next step, competing on Dana White's Contender Series with a shot at a UFC contract on the line. Uh, it's, it's a big opportunity, that's for sure. I mean, it's something I've been training for since I started, and it's just finally make a dream kind of coming true, first step of it. But my, my training camp is probably the best it's ever been. I'm just trying to keep myself calm and relaxed about it and just take it as another fight because, I mean, they're just going to keep getting bigger after this one. For Azure, it's a turning point in a life defined by toughness and resiliency. Growing up on the Fort Peck Indian Reservation was no cakewalk, and he hopes to be a role model for future generations in the community. Yeah, I mean, I, I want to make the best of this opportunity and just show show people, like, hey, there's there, there's always a way out. There's, mm -hmm. there's uh, just whatever your mind wants to do, I mean, if you really want to do it, like there, there's doors that will lead you there. You just got to find those right doors and the right people. Azure is undefeated in six professional fights. Next week, he'll fight fellow undefeated bantamweight Chris Ocon on ESPN Plus with an entire state behind him. Preparation-wise, I didn't I, I didn't change up my training in any way specific for him because mm -hmm. he's definitely not going to be the hardest fight I have in my life. So... It's just about growing in each in each part of the game. I mean, it's just it's just been part of my lifestyle, I guess, since I started. It's just it's just hard work and mm -hmm. what what you're gonna do, go do it. Tom Wiley, MTN Sports.